So I had to see it to believe it, but clearly Risky Reels has been removed. As you can see here, it was replaced by a giant block. And check out this llama in a tree. This is not playground mode, this is live. This little booger camping his butt off in a tree. What are you doing up here, buddy? So let's talk about this. Risky Reels, one of my favorite landing spots in the entire game has been removed and replaced with the block. You can see the sign has been knocked down. Can you still break it? Yeah, you can still break it. Can you break the block? That is the question, let's see. No, you cannot. So, what is this and why, why did they remove? I can't believe they put this in the game. It, it almost looks like a glitch. Like this is uh, some placeholder that shouldn't be here. Why is this here? The block. So let me read you an article that they just released. It says, The Block. Become Fortnite famous. It's time to kick off a Fortnite block party. The most exciting and imaginative islands built in creative will be featured on the block in the Battle Royale map. Can you create something that will inspire the world? Will you become Fortnite famous? So then it says, The Block is a new feature that will improve and evolve over time. To kick things off, we're gonna provide a few guidelines to make the submission process smooth. Here's what we're looking for. A 25 by 25 tile area on a flat section of your island. It's very important that your creations can fit nicely on the block. And then it says, try to keep your memory used less than 50,000. I don't know what that means. But then it says, efficiency is just as important as creativity. And lastly, it says chests, floor loot, and vehicle spawns will be determined by Epic. No need to include these. And lastly, it says, we encourage you to share your creations with your friends and on social media using the Fortnite block party hashtag. We'll be looking closely at social for candidates. The block party begins now, start building. So let's be serious for a second. Why did they remove Risky Reels when they had this whole plot of land right here? This is where the soccer stadium that was introduced for like a week sat. This whole area is huge. Why did they remove a huge point of interest here? It, it just makes no sense to me. I mean, if it's just a 25 by 25, they could have put it somewhere else. Risky Reels, to me, was a great landing spot. I mean, it was modified at least three times since it came out. And it had plenty of chess. It was competitive. It had a lot of angles, a lot of houses, a lot of hiding points. It was a great area. It just boggles my mind that they left this. Maybe they have something else in store for over here. But I really loved Risky Reels. And the fact that they just left it the block right now. So I don't know when this actually starts. But there's no loot here. There's absolutely nothing. It's just a waste of space. I guess, oh, it looks like they left the chest on the outskirts of Risky. And the fact that they left the name Risky Reels is just a slap in the face. <laughs> oh, look, this poor guy landed here. So let me know. What do you guys think? Were you a fan of Risky Reels? Do you think they should have taken it out for this? I mean, the concept is nice. The fact that someone, well, potentially multiple people, can be famous. I'm going to kill this guy. I'm going to be mean and absolutely kill this guy. Actually, I lost him. I don't know where he went. He's probably hiding. Oh, he's in the bush. Look. Hello, my friend. <laughs> Mr. Wimpy Dibble, what a name. I don't know. I'm, I'm just curious what everyone thinks of this. I was not a fan of them removing Risky. But like I said, it is cool that potentially someone or multiple people could be famous. So I myself haven't used the creative mode yet. And I think, correct, someone correct me if I'm wrong, but I think you only get it if you buy the Battle Pass. I'm not 100% sure about that. So I'm going to have to go in there and toy around because it would be cool to be put in the game. I don't know how they're going to advertise, like if I made it. If I made the winning thing, would my name then be on it or just my creation? Like, how would anyone know it was mine? Let's say I developed uh, the factories. Remember the factories that were near Dusty Divot? Or Dusty Depot, rather, sorry. What if I made that and it got voted in? Would my name be on it somewhere or just my creation? Because nobody would know that I did that unless I blasted it all over social media. Like, how is, how is the winner going to be actually recognized? That's what I want to know. So I'm not creative at all. I, I'm absolutely terrible. But I know there's so many creative folks out there that are just waiting to get a chance to do this. So this is going to be super exciting to see 
what people come up with. But I also don't know, do we as fans get to vote the popular ones or do they as developers pick? Because I would love to see some Call of Duty maps be put in here. One of my subscribers has been tweeting me on Twitter uh, examples of like nuke, Nuketown and Shipment and he made those. I don't know if he's making them for this contest, but I would love that. I don't know if that's copyrighted material by Activision at Call of Duty. I don't know, but it would be super cool. But I don't know, let me, let me know what you guys think. Are you a fan that Risky Reels got removed? Do you think it should have been some other area? Maybe some uh, lesser known areas? I, I would have said Flush Factory, but they, they clearly did away with that already. So the fact that we lost Greasy Grove, which I think is coming back by the way, and Risky Reels in a matter of two days is just absolutely heartbreaking, but it is cool. It's a cool concept. The fact that a few of you guys get to be famous and we get to play on your creations would be nice. I just wish they used a different area. So this actually happened live in game last night. I guess they announced this at the awards ceremony, some kind of video game awards. I don't know, I, I didn't keep up with that. But if, if you witnessed this in game, it, I think it would have been pretty cool to see it just crumble and then this big block appear and replace Risky Reels because I was playing on Risky last night and this was not there. So it happened after I went to bed last night, but I'm just super bummed, risky. The point of interest has been removed, but I am a little excited to see what you guys can create. So let me know in the comments if you enjoy this or not, and if you're gonna be creating something. Hopefully I can help, maybe tweet it at me, and hopefully I can help blast it on social media and get you guys some attention.